Why would men want to approach women when they no longer have to worry about just being rejected, but also have to worry about being accused of harassment? Oh, if I was a man, mm, I would be hard to approach a woman in this day and age. So, so what advice would you give to a man to approach a woman that he likes without being perceived as creepy? Go slow. Be careful. Watch your wording. Because sexual harassment, um, being in HR, sexual harassment is a very big thing, and it doesn't matter how you perceive it, but others. So you really, really have to watch your wording. So I guess you would have to meet that person on their ground level and say, hey, this is what I'm looking for. Who is more likely to care what society thinks, men or women? Women. Who is more likely to follow trends? Women. Why would women care what society thinks if we're living in a world that oppresses them? Because they're judged more heavily. They are oppressed, so they feel like they need to show out and act a certain way or like fit into a crowd so that they can't be judged as heavily. A man isn't going to get judged as heavily as a woman walking down the street. Why do women often talk about how they secretly run the world, but then also complain about how they are so oppressed? Women secretly do run the world because we have control over the men, the right men. But in the system, like when it comes down to the facts, men are in power. So we have to be secret about it. We can never just be out front about it or we'll ruin our power. We can never be out front about it. Goofy bitch. YouTube, what's going on, man? I am back. I'm back with another video. Please give this a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Now, fellas, I show y'all. I showed y'all this video because I want you to understand how the dating world is right now. Ever since we had that Me to Movement organization, plus more stuff. The dating world is just going down because, we, you know, there are some women with bad intentions. There are, some, there are some women that do not want to work. So the only way for them to get money is to accuse you of harassment. And then they find a way to get money from courts. They find, they, they find a way to get money from um, organizations like Me Too movements and all that. See what I'm saying? I don't know how they do their things, but y'all know what I'm talking about. Now, um, the first woman, she say, you have to come... You, you have to come slow and low. Back then, we would just approach a woman. And if she don't like you, she'll tell you, well, um, I appreciate I, I appreciate you, but I'm not interested. I have somebody. Oh, and then that's it. It'll be good, right? But these days, if you're not six feet something, and if you don't have muscles, or if you don't have a nice car waiting for your outside, and you approach a woman, and she feel threatened, because you're not the you're not the type of dude that they're looking for, she view this as, oh, you being a widow, or you harassing her. And I don't understand. How come a simple thing has become this big, huge problem? Furthermore, the second girl, oh my God, we have power over men. So, 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 so that explains why a lot of y'all get those cases, those false accusation cases. And it's crazy because it's, it's because of money. Nothing else. It's not like, it's not like they really feel threatened. It's because of money. Because of money and validation. And like I told you before, some women are lazy. So they do not want to work. So the only way for them to make a big fortune is accusing another man of whatever we are just talking about. I, I just don't want to get demonetized. But this, this is this is this is the world that we're living in right now. But they'll tell you this: no man wants to approach me. No, bro. I seen a girl cry because she went to two bars and no man approached her. She, she went to two bars, no man approached her. She got home, she was crying like a little bitch. Oh my God, no man found me attractive. But let a man 
that she didn't see those unrealistic men that they actually want let just just let this man approach her and it's not the type of man that she was looking for she'll bug out and ladies make this make sense because right now it is a dangerous world right now everything everybody feel hurt right now everybody, everybody feel hurt bro especially they they have some unrealistic expectations but they can't they can hold up to to, to to whatever they're asking for second a lot of women are lazy these days so the easiest route is to do only fans because only fans you can just take a picture of your coach and just post it online and you get simps that comes here and just just pour money into her 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 her, her only fans right some dude just come in and just pour money into her, you know, her OnlyFans. Just give it, just give it to her for free. And then after that, when she's looking for a valuable man, a man with morals and integrity, we're looking at that. We're like, uh-uh, we, 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 no, 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 no. We don't want to do that. No, no, no. We don't want to do that. So what she say next? Oh, men hate women. Oh, because we don't like you. Because we don't like what you do. Oh, now we hit women. We misogynist. Make this shit make sense, fellas. It don't make no sense these days. So my advice to y'all fellas when you're approaching a woman. Be careful. I'm not I'm not gonna tell you like to pick your pick your words and 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 and, and and pick your words correct. Nah, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to say pick your words correct. Just approach like a G. I would not recommend doing that in, um, in the workplace. Because it, it could easily. You know what I'm saying? But if you're outside. Approach just like you would approach. And if, she, if, if you feel like she. You know, for some reason she don't find you attractive or she's not interested, then you move on. Easy. But you gotta be a little more careful now. Because these days it's a lot of uh gold diggers out here. These days it's a lot of uh lazy women that that want to find a way to get to the bag easier and quicker. Y'all heard about Chris Brown. Y'all heard about the girl that lied on, on him. And then after that, she's texting him, talking about, oh, I, oh, I miss you. I want it again. I want it again in my guts. So you, so you said he, see what I'm saying? He S-A, right? And then, for you to call him again and say, oh, I miss you. When can I see you again? When can we do it again? That proves my whole point, fellas. And it's happening over and over and over and over and over again. Please like and subscribe. Until next time.